Lovers, 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 what is good, what is good, what is good? It is Wednesday and we are halfway through the week, baby. Thank you. I like to give praise to Divine for flowing this beautiful love magic through me, baby. Let me tell you something, lover. You got to stop being a fool with your love. And let me let you know what I mean by that. Because let me tell you something. Because I don't fear love, I used to just give my love away to everybody. I love you. I love you. Here you go. I love you. I love you. And that's just who I am. I, I can't help who I am. And and you can't knock who you are. But you can change the company that you choose to keep. You feel me, baby? And let me let you know something, lover. All I have ever grown up around was love abuse. So that's all I knew. So I thought it was normal. That shit was normal. But it ain't normal, baby. Hurt people hurt people. And you got to learn how to pull yourself up out of that shit, baby. Because let me tell you something, boo. You got to understand why it is so important to love you first. When you love you first, you take time for you. You take care of you. You are basically nurturing the God in you. You are nurturing your purpose. You are nurturing the calling that is in your heart. Oh, do y'all see my manicure? I did it myself, y'all. I'm feeling myself right now. But anyway, let me get back to the topic at hand. I am grateful for the gift that's within me. And when you nurture and take care of your heart, oh my gosh, you'll be amazed at how many gifts just start opening up and how your heart just starts popping open. Got to get them chakras aligned, baby. You got to, you know, flow with your love. Sometimes it requires being by yourself completely. I have cut so many people off. I ain't going to hold you up, lovers. I cut a lot. I even cut family members off. If you are not loving me the way I'm loving me, I got to pull a guy on you once again and say bye-bye. <laughs> Man, I tell you, I feel so light. I feel free. And one thing I can tell you, lover, is because you have fought hard for your love that's in you, you need to make sure that everybody on your motherfucking team is fighting for you just as hard as you have fought for you. And if they're not, it's okay. Pray for them. You know, pray for them because they're not strong enough to hold your full pint, your full love, your full gallon love. Not even full pint. They're pint-sized lovers. You are deeper than the abyss. You understand? You are deep as the ocean. So when your love is deep, there's going to be people that are going to drown, baby. And you know what? That's not your problem. You know, it's not your problem. They got to either learn how to get their weight up and, 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 and listen, look, look at me float lead by, I lead by example. I, I, I follow strong people. I like to see strong people, strong women, strong men, because let me tell you something, only the strong survive to live the best life that they choose for themselves. And myself, I don't know about you lovers, but I choose stronger love for me. And even if that means me standing in my own freaking box by myself, at least I know it's me and God in this uh, in this in this ship right here, and ain't nobody drilling holes in it. Cause I ain't sinking. I ain't trying to sink for nobody no more. So when you love yourself, lover, you stay grounded in the God, and you stay true to yourself. You know, I enjoy sharing my testimonies with you guys because I know that it is touching someone. I don't care. Like I always tell you, I don't care if it's just one, two, three. That's one, two, three million to me. Because all of us are worthy of the love that we give to ourselves. When you have just been a loving, nurturing person, or you're an empath like me, I'm an empath, so I have a great deal of empathy for people. But at the same time, I realize, shit, I got to start having more empathy for myself, baby, because these motherfuckers is trying to kill me. <laughs> and once I realized that and I got smart, baby, I fixed this crown, I straightened this crown up, and I said, you know what? Let me repo my love back for me and focus on the God that's within me and stay focused on my purpose. And once you learn what your purpose is, you'll only learn it once you love yourself. Your purpose is your testimony. The life you've been through, whatever you've gone through, share it. Share it with somebody. Because let me tell you something. Your love can help save the love in someone else. There's too many people committing suicide for no reasons. And I can honestly tell you from experience, lover, I have tried many times. You feel me? I think that's why I rocked this freaking tattoo on my arm to remind me of all the scars that I placed on myself because of other people, you know, because I, I, I grew up around a lot of narcissistic energy and that energy lover, you cannot take that with you on your journey. Yes, you can speak about it so that it can, so that it can shed light on somebody else's darkness. But at the same time, don't carry that pain. Don't let that pain follow you, baby. 
Let that shit go, let go, and let flow, and just be the true version of you. I'm sitting down here on my floor, and I just got this thought, and I said, let me just pass this on to a lover. Love yourself. Love on you. And cut out what does not love you. Cut out what does not serve your highest good. Your highest good is the God in you. And if you're not taking care of the God in you, how you expect for the God to take care of you, baby? So take care of you. Know that I love you. I got some amazing things about to happen. I'm about to take this big ass jump, lover. So stay tuned because I am going to be recording the whole mission. Because one thing I, I understand is knowledge is power. You reach one, you teach one. And whatever you learn, you pass it on to someone else. Because we haven't all been taught. So what's the point of walking around not teaching others what you've learned? What's your purpose? Find out what your purpose is by loving on you first. I love you all. Listen, catch me on the gram. S-U-G-S dot love dot seven. at Shooks love dot seven on the gram. Know that I love you, baby. And remember, make self-love your mission. Because when you make self-love your mission, divine will place an amazing mission within you. And that light will come on like, boop. <laughs> I love you all. Have an amazing, amazing day, lovers. Right now, I'm just flowing in my zen and staying focused on the God in me. And I pray that you continue to flow and stay focused with the God in you. I thank you all for your love and thank you for your support. And thank you for riding this love train with me. All aboard. Woo, woo. Mwah.